game back with another video man you just not tuned into the channel make sure you hit that subscribe button make sure you turn that bell on so you get notified every single time i make a video y'all know what i am man classic viewing dmc 844 one more eight, time. 833. 833 Eastern, Eastern Boulevard. Boulevard. Montgomery, Alabama. 36117. And if y'all y'all have seen this guy in my video plenty of time, man, this is the manager, the big dog, the king, the dead dollar, the legend, the myth, the man himself, Mr. Brett, man. He gonna take care of you. If you come to this dealership, just tell him Rob sent you. Man, they got sports cars, they got luxury, they got sedans, they got soccer mom vehicles, they got trucks, they got whatever you need, man. But we, we'll talk about all that later. But as y'all can see with today's video consists of 2023 Cadillac Escalade V. Man, I've been trying to get a hold of this truck for the longest. He called me up, he said, hey man, you won't believe what I got on this showroom floor. And I seen it, he sent me a picture and I was like, bro, I almost got a ticket trying to get here, man. <laughs> this thing is absolutely beautiful, man. From the black to the wheels to the caliber six prints, the brakes, the engine. Of course, it's supercharged. Over 680 horsepower, man. And I know y'all just heard the exhaust. And don't worry, we got a whole little uh, commentary of everything that's going on with this truck. All the inside features, all the outside features, the gadgets, the this and that, the ins and outs. I've already showed y'all all the glam shots, man, but you know, look at this dash, man. Look at the screens. You know what I'm saying? Everything is digital. It looks like a whole little spaceship right here, man. these specific features that we do not see in other Escalades. So what can you show me? So let's talk about it. Let's go to V-Mode. Yeah, it's pretty open up to actually exhaust, right? No, it's not. Right? I did this all the time. Well, let's talk about this, okay? So when you go to V-Mode, we have six different customizable attributes and characteristics of the vehicle. When you put it in the sport mode, you're actually raising the steering effort on purpose to make the steering feel heavy. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. All right, so there's a reason behind it. It's all about the way you feel, though. It's not really like a benefit in the you know for the performance. It's just about the, what you feel. Now, all-wheel drive. Okay, it's got tour, sport, snow, and ice. Well, it starts out at 50-50 distribution, and then it moves all the way over to snow and ice to where you can have 70 and 30. But when you go to the sport setting for brake feel, it actually forces you to apply a little bit more force so that you have more control over how it squeezes off with the block, and they actually walk the engine through the build process from start to finish. So it's not like they have a station set up to do this part of the engine build and then they pass it off to someone else, right? They don't do it that way for these specific motors. Um, for this one, uh, the person here is uh, Crystal Strickland. Um, you can see right here it says Performance Build Center USA. Uh, 6.2 liter V8 right there was built by one person in uh, the heart of America, Bowling Green, Kentucky. So.
good. Damn. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. That is so loud. Listen to this. Hold on. This is the crazy thing about it. you don't hear that window go up. Oh, you really don't. I was waiting to hear some. <laughs> I, was, I was waiting to hear some, bro. That's crazy. Oh, no, nah, that is crazy. Normally, and, and y'all know what sound we're talking about. You know what sound when the window when the window goes up and down. Uh, uh, you don't hear that. Yet. <laughs> but but yeah, man. Oh man, you know I wish I had my freaking GoPro, but it's all right. We're gonna make it do what it do, baby. All right, man. Man, I can hear. I ain't even hit the gas hard yet, man. This truck, I, I already hit the exhaust. We good to go. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> bro, it's still popping. Oh, bro, this is insane. On a SUV, I ain't want to hit too hard leaving the dealership, man. But. Man, I, I think I got a good look. I'm gonna go straight, man. <laughs> Bro, this exhaust, man. Yeah. Dog, this truck is so smooth, man. I'm, I, it's like I, I wanna, I wanna get a good little amount of gas, but I don't wanna, you know what I'm saying? I don't wanna do nothing crazy, man. Dog, just and on, not, not even just put aside the horsepower for a minute, you know. Just the overall drivability of it is so smooth, bro. Like, you know you got a supercharger in there and you know where to go, but it's not jerky. It's not, you know what I'm saying? It's a, a smooth ride and it's gonna pull. <sighs> man, all right, we uh, let me just get on the little highway of Mexico real quick, man. Hold on, I can't ride it right, hold on. 